when you think of the history of these United States in the 20th century, as you just said, the 1950s mm. are sort of this high water mark. But that high water mark came because, in particular, in the 1920s, Hollywood began producing pornography mm -hmm. during the jazz era. And this shocked the consciences of the Protestant majority of the, these, these states. But they couldn't organize because they were so divided. So there was a there was a moral issue. But then the Catholics when the Catholics got involved. They spearheaded it and they, they were able to lead a, a, a sort of true ecumenism, which is called the Legion of Decency. And this, there was counterparts in other places like Germany. They they organized a na nationwide boycott of these Hollywood films allow to the point that they were able to throttle Hollywood, bring Hollywood to its knees. <clears throat> And Hollywood could not lift a finger unless the Catholic Church said so. Uh -huh. And all the other Christians, including a few Jews, too, got on board with the Catholic Catholic led initiative. Uh -huh. And this was reaching this high mark in the 1950s. And that's why Fulton Sheen was uh, primetime television. And Hollywood was now producing movies like uh, Our Lady of Fatima, you uh -huh. know, produced by Warner Brothers. Can you imagine? Yeah, <laughs> but because because there was in the 1960s, there was a massive initiative among the clergy to lay down our weapons and dialogue with the Antichrist, mm -hmm. give the medicine of mercy to the Antichrist. Then the Antichrist counterattacked. And since then, in these states, there's been among the Catholics, at least. Uh, an effort to dialogue with the Antichrist, and uh, that's been going nowhere because the Antichrist has just been destroying us. Mm -hmm. um, but if, if we think about the history of Christian militancy in these states led by the Catholics, it, it's it is a it is quite a glorious history in the 20th century, considering the fact that Catholics, especially, um, has have really been um, ostracized by the majority mm -hmm. Protestant WASP elites in this country. Um, Catholics were unapologetically leading this charge um, and we can lead it again. Mm -hmm. And like what you just did, like you just said, I mean, how many of those people who came out and congratulated you in your, in your reparation procession, were they even Catholic? Who knows? But mm -hmm. they, they understood what you were doing. They saw the banners of Jesus. They saw the cross. They were like, that, that's, that warms my heart. <laughs> <laughs> Not like this other stuff that makes me want to throw up.